Hey everyone, Zach Hample here, and it is time to pick prize winners for my 2015 fundraiser for the charity Pitch In for Baseball. For those who don't know, this is a charity that provides baseball and softball equipment to underprivileged kids all over the world. I've been raising money for them every season, starting with 2009, and this year in particular was a big year for me because when I snagged A-Rod's 3,000th hit, I worked out a deal with the Yankees where they gave $150,000 to the charity. So with everybody's help, I've now raised more than $190,000 over the last six years. And here's the culmination of the 2015 season. So I want to show you quickly the prizes that are being offered and then we'll start picking names. So probably the best prize that I'm giving away is this baseball signed by Willie Mays. You can see it's an official major league ball. So Willie Mays right there, I predict that one will go first. Over here, we have, if you can get a nice close-up shot, we have a, a commemorative ball with Bernie Williams on it with some text about his career. Uh, over here, another prize will be a Mickey Mantle commemorative ball with some of his stats on the side. All right. Now these three t-shirts here will be given away as one prize. They were from the Free Shirt Fridays at City Field last year. All right. Uh, these three baseball cards, if you can get a shot that uh, doesn't have so much of a glare on it, um, you can see that, let's see, well they're all autographed, there's Kent Herbeck, Rick Cerrone, and Dave Steeb over there. Uh, there's a nice skylight overhead casting a, a glow down on us. These two things, um, these were sort of mini posters given away at City Field. This one is David Wright running out in onto the field into position, and this was a photo from opening day, the very first game at Shea Stadium back on April 17th, 1964. This is a book that was written by a friend of mine, John Hart. He will personalize it, autograph it for the person who wins it. So when you win it and claim it, just let me know how you want it signed. These are a couple of kids' books, um, baseball books written by another friend. These are already signed. You can see that he signed them in 2013, but I'm giving them away now because he gave me a bunch at the time. So a couple of kids' books. Here's a Mark McGuire rookie card from his stint on Team USA back in the mid-80s. Awesome prize right there. And uh, yeah, basically, um, you know, those are the 10 prizes. Did I mention that the baseballs are, are three individual prizes, but the t-shirts combined are one prize, these two posters are one prize, these two books are one prize, these three cards are one prize. We also have a Curtis Granderson bobblehead that was given away at City Field a little while ago, so that's a prize as well. And if you see here, we have everybody's name on a slip of paper. These are the people who donated money to the fundraiser. Basically, if you gave a dollar to the charity, for every game home run ball I snagged this year, you get your name in the prize once. So last, uh, in, in previous years I did it according to, I, I did it according to uh, the total number of baseballs that I snagged, but this year it was game home runs only. So I got eight home run balls. If you give eight bucks, you're in there once. Uh, Todd Cook is in there 50 times, gave a lot of money. So he's a favorite to certainly get his name picked at least once. Will it be first? We'll find out. So get a shot of these names right here. And we are going to basically gather them all up. There might be a more efficient way of doing this, but I think this is the most fun. So we're going to put these names on the paper and very carefully. We will now put the names in this little bowl-like thing. And here comes the fun part. I'm gonna mix it up. Nothing in my hand. And I will just say that you only get to win one prize, even if your name is picked multiple times. So if you're picked first, you get your first choice of all these prizes. But if you're picked second or at any other point, you don't win a second prize, we'll just keep picking names. So here we go. The first winner of the 2015 Pitching for Baseball fundraiser is gonna be James Lee. Can we get a little shot of James Lee on there? All right, so congratulations, James. I think he was in there about 25 times. Second winner 
will be Andy Bingham. Uh, you don't need to get a shot of each one. I'm just going to lay them down and we'll, we'll get a shot at the end or maybe halfway through. Again, there's no slip of paper in my hand. We're not, we're not trying to stage this in any way. Winner number three will be... Uh-oh, we got James Lee again. So we will keep picking. And the third winner will be Elliot Marsh. Congratulations to Elliot. Put him right up there. Fourth winner will be Ray Burton. I know that guy. He lives in Australia. All right, so we have four winners so far. And the person who will get to make the fifth selection is we have Andy Bingham again, so we hold him out. We will keep drawing. And we have, uh-oh, Ray Burton again. We'll keep it going. All right, there's Todd Cook with the fifth choice. Number six coming up is, uh-oh, Elliot Marsh again. Another pick for the sixth selection will be Chris Wood. All right, so we have four more names to draw. How much time do we have left? Three and a half minutes. You don't have to whisper. Shout it out, three and a half minutes. We have James Lee again. So this is a weird old camera that can only do 10 minute videos and then it shuts off. So we want to wrap this up. So we're trying to get a seventh name here and we have Kathy Gary. Come on over here for one second, and let's get a close-up shot of these names. There we go. Those are the names that we have so far. All right. And here we go. We're going to do the eighth pick for the charity prizes. And that is Chris Wood again. Come on, guys, enough. Share the love. Share the wealth. Wait, we have two. So these two will be picked together. Let's see. And they are, well, Liz Mary has not been picked, and Ray Burton already has, so that works out. Congratulations, Liz. We need two more. And we have Andy Bingham again. Come on. Come on, guys. Come on. It's hard to grab these little slips. Ray Burton, ah, oh. We got two names again together here. We already have a Todd Cook, so we're going to throw him out. And we have a Stuart John. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we need to pick one more name. The person who will receive the last prize, whatever's left over, this will be yours. Hopefully it'll be something good. Okay, we got two names again. Ray Burton is out. James Lee is out. One and a half. One and a half minutes to go. Dave Forstad, there it is. All right. So, let me see the camera here for a second. So this will be the order in which people get to pick. James Lee will get to go first. Andy Bingham, Elliot Marsh, Ray Burton, Todd Cook, Chris Wood, Kathy Gary, Liz Mary, Stuart John, and Dave Forstad. That is 10, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so... Basically, there you have it. Thank you to everybody for donating money this year. I do plan to do this again in 2016. I've already been saving up prizes, so you know, wait till I announce it. Um, give more money. It helps the charity even if you don't win something, but I'm planning to give away another uh, Hall of Famers autograph next year as well. So yeah, thanks to the Argosy Bookstore for donating stuff and for letting me film here. And yeah, enjoy the winter and I look forward to a huge 2016 season.